Hey, it's Matt from Does United, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can easily add the product if you have an issue made with WooCommerce. If you want to learn more, make sure to check the description as there are some useful links about website development and app development in general. So, let's say that you have created your first store, but you are not sure how you can add products to it. So, let's go over it and open up your WordPress dashboard and here scroll down a little bit until you find WooCommerce and click on the WooCommerce products and categories. Wait for it to load. And then you can just add your first category and you can see that I already have some of the categories there. So let's say you want to sell, for example, bags. So just type bags here. For the Slack, you can leave it empty or you can just make your custom one. It just means that your category will be displayed in the URL. So it will be like bags up there. You can name it a little bit different if you want. For the parent category, it means if you are selling, for example, bags and you want to make a new subcategory called, for example, handbags and some bigger bags or something else. Then for the description, you can just type what this category is about and the display type will be, for example, what you want to use, like products or subcategories, or you can just choose both. That means that in the store, it will be displayed, for example, if you click on the bags, it will just show bags on the top and subcategories also as the items or it will just be that you want to show products for example. Then for the thumbnail, you want to upload a picture of the category. It can be like something like bag or anything else you want to use as a picture of your category that will be shown somewhere in the store page for example like here or anywhere else you want to put your category to. So once you are uh, satisfied with your setup, just click on add new category and you'll be added as a new category. And I have already created a bags category, so I'm not going to do it second time. Once you have created your category, go over and click on add new under the products and name your new product for example big back then you can write some custom description about your product that will be also shown on the product page so when i open any of my items i can see that i have written some description about the product so i can just copy it and paste it there Okay, so once more, there is something weird with my text, but when you write your text, it should be fine. Then, when you are adding product, just make sure to choose a category you want to add the product to. It can be one or two categories as well, or even more. Then, just make sure to specify the price you want to sell your product for, which can be done. Okay, so now my page is loaded and you can see that the description is correctly shown. And just to make sure, you want to also put a price of your item. So let's say I want to sell it for 150 Danish krona. You will have probably some other currency like dollar or euro there. And also make sure to set product image. I can use, for example, this image. I'm going to see this as product image. And then when I click, click on the publish, it will be added as a new product into my store. So when I click on the bags again, it should already be shown there. And you can see that the big bag has been added to my store. When I open up this product, 
it will show the description of the product and I can add it to the cart and when I add it to the cart I can just check my cart and I can make a payment. Thank you very much for watching, if you like the video please consider subscribing and liking the video and make sure to follow the links in the description if you want to learn more about website development and app development in general. If you have any questions just leave a comment and I will try to answer them all. Thank you and bye.